Making friends can be difficult and school can be lonely. I needed to make notes, so many notes. I wasn't being rude and not listening. I was listening really hard and trying to write it all down because if I couldn't see it, it didn't exist. Don't ever give instructions or homework anywhere near transition times. That fiddling with things like blue tack or doodling actually means I'm listening. If I'm not fiddling, I physically cannot concentrate to listen. Working memory is poor, so scaffolding is key. Becoming overwhelmed with too much information can lead to a feeling like failure. From the parent's angle, ask staff not to single the parent out publicly at pickup. It reinforces bad child for all to see and causes untold damage to both the parent and the child. ADHD can be a superpower if you let it thrive. There is a huge amount of internalized shame. We want to do well. We try, but can't get it quite right. I was never uninterested in their teachings. I just either got it really quick or needed more stimulation to be able to process the information. If you're going over things we already learned, I will find it almost unbearably boring and want to leave the room. My disorganisation isn't due to lack of effort. I just struggle to remember things unless I can physically see them. While reading, the class needs to be silent or I'm listening to every other conversation instead. ADHD is not a difficulty of knowing what to do, but doing what you know. If I haven't demonstrated learning, I need support with the demonstrating and not with the learning. I will forget everything. Please send home reminders to keep parents in the loop. It's not Naughty Boys Syndrome.